Hello, folks, and welcome to Troubleshooter, Man and Children. All right, we've got Ray up to 24. I think that's actually pretty good. She's also got Healing Mist power, as you can see right here. We can now use Healing Mist, which is great. Let's go ahead and go to Mission Control, and let's do our level 27 story mission, because I'm sure it's totally fine and not all a trap. Not a trap at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Why would it be a trap? Crazy talk. All right, it's snowing. Apparently it's winter time now. Is it snowing or those stars? I mean, it looks like it was snowing before. I guess it, those are might be stars in the sky and it's snowing. Like why pick, right? It's a false choice. Usually you don't see the stars that way though. though. I don't know. It could just be kind of like hazy instead of cloudy. That's the problem with with pictures. Sometimes you just look at them and you just think too much about them. Alright, story time. Oh, hey, it is snow. It's totally snow. It is not stars at all. I don't know what you're talking about. It's craziness. Two months have passed since the roads were colored red from the clash between the White Tiger Gang and the Spinners. First snow of the year came a little earlier than it would have in the Windham Wall District. The snow that started to fall from the early dawn of the day whiten the world by the early morning. The clash between the Spoonists and the White Tiger Gang calmed down for a moment, and the civilians were able to greet a morning quieter than any other time. The civilians knew the silence was just temporary. But they all hoped this moment would last forever. <laughs> and then gunfire. Don't waste time, wipe them all out. The ruthless violence of the White Tiger Gang already dominated the civilians, and the civilians didn't call the police anymore because no one wanted to become a victim of the White Tiger Gang. I'm sorry, sir, but our company is heading towards the Resource Management District now. The police were incapable of dealing with all the crimes. Troubleshooters went for beast hunts for profit and to avoid conflict with the White Tiger Gang. Moreover, moving to other safe districts was forbidden in Valhalla. A number of civilians blamed Valhalla for its unreasonable behavior. And they joined the Spoonists. Oh, great. fan fucking tastic the Spoonists were the only organization that could confront the resentful Valhalla. The Spoonist doctrine Spoonage touched the minds of the poor souls. Meanwhile, there were also some civilians who pursued changes within Valhalla. They wanted to abolish the troubleshooter policy. That's a horrible idea. They proposed the establishment of an army for strong public order. Valhalla is not allowed to have an army. That's in like the first hour of the backstory. Come on, guys. Even I know that, and I don't live in Valhalla. Choose a character to proceed the story with. Um, Alright, let's see what they give us some little hints. The war for the event will be varied depending on the character you choose. The missed events will be available in the case record. Okay, so we can go back and redo this mission as somebody else. Well, in that case, let's just start with Albus, and maybe we'll do these later on. We'll probably need the experience after all. Just out for a jog. Or maybe he's actually running to get somewhere. It'll be winter soon. Dude, it's winter now. If there's snow on the ground, it's fucking winter. Peace of the Universe is now composed of six members as Ray joined the team. Well, technically. Technically, yes, there's six members. However, officially, only two of those are troubleshooters. It now has a sufficient number of members to solve a case when cooperating with the police force. However, it was still difficult to split up the team to solve multiple cases at once. There weren't enough members to share the accumulating fatigue caused by continuously solving cases. Black Pearl was a really good company when I think about them now. Black Pearl was a company of the y Yggdrasil district where Albus completed his apprenticeship and got his first job. It is one of the major troubleshooter companies that had more than 100 official troubleshooters. Now, I have PC Universe and my team members. And each of our team members are no worse than a troubleshooter of Black Pearl. Don't, don't, wouldn't a better way to phrase that would be each of our team members is better than a troubleshooter of Black Pearl? Because, come on, how many of them could be, like, Irene or Scion? Or, I mean, Hexing's pretty cool. And needs some work, I'll admit, but she's 14. She'll grow into it. One of our Albus, as the leader of the company, felt the gap in case-solving ability due to a shortage of team members. It was hard for him not to think of his old days as an apprentice. This must mean that I'm not capable of being a good boss. Boy, Albus, the imposter syndrome is real. 
You're good, man. Don't worry about it. Oh, I'm completely late. He also looks completely lost. Let's take a shortcut through here. Oh, that's a bad idea, Albus. Shot in the face. Oh, man. Albus, you fucking moron. All right. If the unit is on error with an icy road in effect, the icon will be shown in the blood bluff on the screen. Attack by ice type damage, gain frostbite. Further knock back and invite by one tile. So I think everything just knocks back by one. Still stance not applied. Decreases your hit chance, decreases your block chance, decreases your dodge chance. So it's just bad all around. Let's get off the fucking icy road. How about that? A bullet passed by Albus's forehead. Okay, so it didn't actually hit him. He just dodged it. Good job, Albus. Sniper. Who is it? The White Tiger Gang? All right. Defeat the sniper that shot Albus. Don't give up. Right. Wouldn't defeat condition would be give up? Like, if you give up, you get defeated, right? So this would seem to indicate that if I don't give up, I get defeated. I guess we'll find out. Oh, no. We totally hit him because he's bleeding. Okay, we need to get... At least, at least he's behind cover, but... Half cover is not going to cut it against this sniper. We need to run as far as possible because we can't see anything. I mean, it's all ice, so we all get the exclamation point, so... I mean, it's probably not a bad idea to heal. So I say we get behind some half cover and heal ourselves. We're not going to be able to see them. We know they're over there somewhere. We don't know exactly where they are, but go ahead and heal yourself up. Hopefully the sniper doesn't get another good shot. Get the bleeding cleared. Let's go behind the full cover. There he is. Is Gazelle? I heard that you started your own business. You've grown up a lot. Shall I see how much better you've gotten since you were an apprentice? Miss Gazelle, could it possibly be... We've met again after so long. Show me a good time, Albus. Oh, we lost his turn. He got shot again. This gives the hell. Stop it. Alvis, you've changed a lot. Now you even know how to yell. Now show me how much stronger you've gotten. Uh, so she's probably a member of the Black Pearl. She was probably his boss. Why'd that woman come here? Oh, now he's in rage state? Oh, that's not good. Don't be in rage state, my dude. Well, I mean, it increases our attack power and ESP power, so I guess it's fine, but... All right, let's walk up to her. Um, we don't know what defenses she has. Kind of wary about walking up to her. Probably the best thing to do, actually, would probably be to win a veil. Because then we get some defenses, right? From win a veil? Let's see. Increases your speed by 10, armor by 50, resistance by 50, wind resistance by 50. I mean, decreases the enemy hit chance by 20%. Thing is, we're currently on ice. We've got to get off the ice first. So we have defense against her here? Yeah. Okay, so get off the ice first. And then Wind Veil, and then hopefully that'll help us not, you know, die. Okay, she's running away. That's not a surprise. Look at that. We dodged it. Thank goodness for Wind Veil. Okay. Now let's go beat her up. Get a little bit of defense right there. If she just keeps on retreating, though, we want all the cover we can get. That was pretty good. Now she's bleeding. And she couldn't move because we got first stalemate. That was great. Miss Gazelle. Miss Gazelle, are you all right? Oh, but you've grown up quite a lot. Not too bad, huh? And you are still the same person I knew before. It was a good choice to fight you. It's been a while since I felt pressure like I did today. Huh? Gazelle Wallenstein. Wallenstein? Might be Stein. It's like Frankenstein, right? You go Frankenstein, not Frankenstein. I mean, you do Frankenstein if you're watching young Frankenstein, because that's what he says to go for, but no, it's totally Frankenstein. Wallenstein is what we want to go for there. She's a troubleshooter of Black Pearl. There we go. But obviously a senior troubleshooter during his apprentice period. What are you doing here anyway? I quit. I was just going for a walk. With a sniper rifle? Do you nor- I mean, I guess it's Valhalla. In Valhalla, if you don't walk around with some kind of weapon, you're probably just asking for it. 
there enough to hunt down in this town? The Eagersville district is a bit boring these days. So you finally defeated the Skull. Now just a repetition of boring days. But it is surprising that you left the company. You should experience working in the same company for 10 years, then you'll understand my feelings. I don't have a family to look after, and the work is just boring. That's why I requested to move into the Windwall District. It doesn't have to be this district, right? There is Red Mining District, district where public order is the worst. You're just uncomfortable that I'm here, aren't you? I have no problem with that, it's just that it's not normal to shoot at someone who's just walking down the street. I intentionally missed. It would have been a murder if you made a mistake, Miss Gazelle. Moreover, what if it wasn't me who was walking down the street? Don't worry, I knew it was you. Just I remember her. I mean, to be fair, he's probably the only guy in the Windwall District with a sword strapped to his back. Be pretty unlikely. Again, anyone armed is probably going to be at least a troubleshooter. Thanks for stopping by to see me, though. Of course, why would I just leave after noticing a fun guy like you? Okay. <laughs> an hour ago, a huge trailer was toppled on a slippery, icy road. The trailer was identified as an illegal beast smuggling vehicle. A number of beasts have escaped the vehicle and are roaming the streets. The police are taking action to restore order in the area. Andre, sir, the police cordon is too tight. It would be hard for us to get through. Oh, well, they'll have to do something about it. Drive the beast into the park, towards the police. This will force them to expand their line to try to contain the scattered beasts. When they do so, we'll break through. Miss Ray, please be the support for Miss Anne. Okay. Anne, I'm counting on you. Yes, Sister Ray. I'll do my best. For Mr. Hexing, please keep the beast away from the residence area so they don't get in there. Alright. Miss Irene. Fine. Please defeat the sea escaping beast quickly. Alright. Let's solve this problem quick. I'm hungry. There'll be no support for the police since they are busy maintaining the perimeter. It'll be hard work, but let's do this, everyone. Okay, defeat all beasts in the park. None of the beasts can leave the site, and of course it'd be better if you know nobody died. Okay, so that's the escape point right there they're all trying to get to. We do not want them to get there. Uh, there's a giant hedge, though, in the way. Why are we over here and not over there? All right, well, we'll just have to go and see what we can do. I guess there's multiple escape points. Yep, okay, so that would be bad for them to get to. Got it. Turn around, make sure there's nothing else around here. This player is huge. There's multiple escape points. This is ginormous. Okay, well, we just gotta do what we can. Uh, looks like the only way in is there. Or there. Uh, technically, I guess it's faster to go this way? And there's no real quick... Yeah, I don't know. I guess we just, we just go. Let's just go. I mean, I would hope you'd be able to, like, knock down the hedges or something, but I guess that's not an option. Yep, that goes that way. Alright, so this is the right way to go. I'm tempted to split this up. Like, we don't want them getting through here, right? So... Yeah, let's get Hexing in the back with, uh, with Irene. And Anne, you're going to go join them. And then Hexing, you're going to go back this way. And then Ray's going to join you. It's not a great split, but it's what we have to do sometimes. All right, come over here. I don't see anybody yet. So far, so good. And let's get you up here. We don't know where anybody is. So we have, I mean, if these are beasts, we know there's the white tiger gang here too. But the beast, it doesn't matter what cover we do. So just go as far as we can. So we heard something from over this way, I think. Let's go up over here. 
It's actually going in the bushes, maybe. Can't go in the bushes. No bush job for me. Alright, come over here then. Don't see anybody yet. Alright, Irene. I guess if we're beasts we're dealing with, it doesn't actually matter if you have cover or not, so just do what you can. Okay, now we just do minor pushes, because now we actually might have bad guys. Not yet, though. Hmm. I'm a little suspicious of the fact we haven't seen anybody yet. Oh, there we go. I mean, I wouldn't exactly call them people, but yes, that would be the bad one. He's pretty strong, too. Uh, what do you think there, Sion? I think you'd be able to zap him with your flash beam. That'd be worth a shot, so to speak. Only 86%. 100% chance to crit. Yeah, let's say we try it. Nice. Good job. Now the rest of them know we're here. That's okay. We knew that was going to happen anyway. Alright, we have our beasts. Alright. Cover again is not going to matter too much. Uh, I think we just go ahead and walk up here and see what happens. Um, I guess I could do this. No, we don't really have any shot. Okay, just wait. Irene, we have a bad guy over there. You can't get to him, though. So, come over here. I wonder if Hexing will be able to get a shot in. Seems unlikely. What do you think, Hexing? Got a shot? We totally have a shot. Yeah, sure, why not? Take the shot. That was pretty good. Nice shot. Alright, keep on pushing forward. We'll need you there. Oh, and the other guy's running. Good for stallment. Okay, so the bees are trying to escape the other way. Definitely take this guy out. There you go. He did not explode, which is great. Kind of where he'd explode into ice or something, but it didn't happen. All right, he just looked at her. Didn't do anything now. Okay, Albus. There's nobody really strong. I guess there's this guy is kind of strong. We can totally, we can totally do this. So I think we'll probably get a crit for this. Yeah, go stand in the bushes. That might be better. Alright. Irene. Try not to step on the ice, will ya? Uh, we'll go follow this path here. I guess we just joined up with them, so there's no point in us doing that in plank motion. Over here and see if we can get a shot. Okay, and the Yasha is great. That's the only thing you have a shot on, huh? Okay, do it. Good crits. Sure, why not? Push a little forward. There's that Tiamat. She just keeps on running away. Alright, Ray, try to keep up. And I don't think you need to do much, I guess. Alright, come over here. And then shoot somebody if you like. Yeah, sure. Um, maybe the strong guy. Oh, I probably should have done the the AOE. That would have been better. All right. Well, speaking of AOE, do a ripple flash. These guys are close to each other. Why not? There you go. We got one of them. This guy's a little weak. What was that? Oh, it was a debuff of some kind. That's not good. Xing, do you have a shot? I think if we come over here. We'll definitely have a shot. Yeah, there you go. Bingo. Okay, so far so good. Still that Tiamat over that way. Uh, I guess Albus has got to chase it down. Let's try to stay off the ice. Oh, found the white tiger. Who's trying to defeat the beast for some reason? You're supposed to drive them into the freaking morons, man. Can't follow basic instructions. 
supposed to drive them towards the police. How does that driving them towards the police? Okay, and what I'd like you to do is go grab this thing. Oh, I think that's, that's... I forget what black is. Is black the items or healing? Items. Alright, items are good. Dowry boots the moon wall, apparently. Uh, I'd like to be able to see the stats, please. No stats for me. Okay, never mind. Send inventory. And no cover, really. But that guy's melee. Cover's really not going to matter. Um, stand out in the bush. There you go. These guys are really bad at their jobs. Somebody has an overwatch. Alright, right. Just go stand next to Hexing for a bit. Okay, Scion. Let's go around this side. Let's keep away from the ice. As much as possible, anyway. You got your overcharge already? That was fast. Um, I'd rather not use it yet, though. Maybe over here. You do have a shot. Not on the poor beast. The beast is doing fine. This guy, though. This guy's a jerk. Take him out. That's pretty close. So he's berserk. He's still on ice. Too much running away. Albus. So if you go up to him, you will be standing on ice, and that would be bad. Instead, let's take our nice defense position and just hit him from here with a range attack. Like it. Gentle gust. Check him out. Alright, Irene. Again, don't want to step on the ice. He's probably going to approach us. Let's go ahead and just stand over here. Uh, we do have a range attack. Let's do that. Good burn. And these guys are going to be a little busy. Why don't you come over here next to Scion? I don't want to go too far forward, but... Um... Hmm. Don't want to leave you behind either. Because we got Ray over here. Let's move her just over to this side. And maybe get rid of this debuff we've got. There you go. Okay, can you run away? Oh, the Tiamat's finally down. Alright, we gotta take these guys, so... Hmm. I'd rather not step on the ice? They don't seem to have ice attacks. Now, the Tiamats might if they're, like, glacier type, but we I think we have actually defeated all the beasts now. So maybe it's fine to be on ice. Not gonna be able to use our overcharge, unfortunately. Well, maybe. Let me come up here. Hello. Punishment Andre. Okay. Let's go ahead and use our overcharge to do Field of Zero. And if these guys come over or try to do anything with us, we can take them out. Or at least, you know, injure them, which might be great too. Alright, so he's ready. And sure enough, he tried to move. That was it. Good job. Good job. Good job. Alright, Irene. Uh, or sorry, that's Ray. That's totally Ray. Ray, come over here. I need you in a bit. Scion. And uh, no cover up here, huh? Oh, there we go. There's cover there. I just can't do anything when I get there. Well, bush is not bad either. Okay. Bush. There are three guys right there. Alright, she's gonna shoot at me. Okay, he blocked it, but he still got hurt. Ooh, though that's um pretty bad. Ann. Oh, you don't really have any cover, Ann. Cover this. Stand in the bushes. It's something. Oh, that's the overwatch shot. That's pretty bad. I mean, a field of zero is pretty good. But let me see if I can hit... Yeah, there we go. Don't hit hexing with it, though. I think it hits hexing regardless. Okay, so then that's bad. But we might be able to take out the swordsman from here. Oh, no, he blocked it, but otherwise we did okay. Alright, we can do this. Hexing still takes damage from this, huh? I mean, there's no reason why he should. 
I think because I'm technically targeting a space. Yeah, okay. That's problematic. And right, we do another range attack. Might take him out. Almost they don't want to get out of don't want to get out of cover. I guess we could stand here that's not iced. And take out the scoundrel. Well, hurt the scoundrel. Not gonna be able to take him out, but we can hurt him. We got like no block chance. I definitely don't want Hexing to take him. Yeah, let's stand there. We can forestall at least. Okay. Irene, it's your chance. Uh, you have to step out of cover though. I guess you'd take the swordsman. That solves Hexing's problem. There. Okay, he's bleeding. Forestalled, so he's out. So much for him. Okay, he's bleeding too, but he's gonna heal. Okay, that was a horrible grenade, or whatever the hell that was. You can zap this guy. Oh, there's another guy behind him. Uh, over here, there's no, like, full cover, is there? Of course not, why would there be full cover? That's just crazy talk. Okay, so then, come over here. And ripple flash, I guess. Worth a shot. Oh, they both dodged it. God damn it. Oh no, one of the beasts escaped. We failed because one beast escaped? One beast. Oh my fucking god. Didn't even know he was there. Okay, now we gotta we gotta retry. One fucking beast. Um, shit. No, I think the retry might actually take us back to Albus, walking alone on the ice. Too late. Okay, so we go with Albus, obviously. I mean, we could go with Scion, but whatever. Go we'll skip this. Okay, yeah, pass by. Okay, so there's a bad guy over this way. Um, the bleed doesn't actually matter, so just go as far as you can. And then go to full cover. Okay, we see the lady. Yada yada yada. Things happened. Okay. What the? <laughs> and that's what happens when you don't heal. Oh no, okay. So it's just fine because she's still... Are you still disappointing me? Wow. That's a dick... Dick move. All right. Okay, so they're gonna babble about nonsense for us for a while. Okay, so you didn't have to win the fight. That's good to know, I suppose. All right, so we had to defeat all the beasts in the park. I don't even know where the hell the beast was. Okay, we defeated some of them going this way, I guess. What needs to happen is we need to establish a perimeter. We've got to go on all sides. we got to go around the park before we go through the park. Maybe? This we can't get distracted by the White Tiger Gang, that's for damn sure. We still can take out the beast. Okay, Irene, I think you still need to go back over here. It did help a little bit be able to take him by two sides, so it's not a horrible idea. Not my best idea in the world, but all I can do right now, I guess we could go further, right? Like, if we go up over here... I mean, the thing is, there's so many possible avenues of escape, like, we have no idea. Okay, Hexing, go inside. We're gonna need your gun in here, for sure. And then Anne... Yeah, come over here. Because we still need to take out the beasts that are inside here. Okay. Okay, but maybe Irene goes, like, the long way? Like, going off by herself is not a great idea, so she'll take Ray with her. 
Actually, in the meantime, we'll come down Got over it. this way. I should probably go ahead and get rid of that mode. Okay, so come over here. This is our first beast. The same thing we did before with Scion. Is we line up the shot. And then we take the shot. Okay, so the beasts show up. Because they say hello. Alright, Albus. I don't think you can necessarily go out on the ice. But you can't come over here. And take this guy with a gentle gust, maybe. Got knocked back at least. Okay, Irene, you've got to go establish a perimeter. Make sure there's no other beast trying to escape. Um, yeah, cover's good. Be behind cover. Basically, she's on a scouting mission. And taking a healing girl with her just in case. Alright, Hexing. Come over here. And maybe a cone? Yeah, a cone will totally work here. <laughs> That was fantastic. Red levels up again. Great. Day 25. That's pretty good. Okay. You are fine. Go ahead and get your vigor back. There's another beast over there. Looks like he might be trying to run for it. That one's definitely trying to run for it. Okay. Albus, we gotta take this guy. Can we do that? Come over here. Oh, that's Anne. Uh, that's fine. Do that. That was pretty good. That worked out. So he's not running that way. But we do have other people. Yeah, that guy's running around. We'll see. Well. I'm just worried about running into some white tiger gang here. I don't know where the hell these guys are going. Uh, Albus, do you have a shot on... You have to go step in the ice. I do not love that idea. These two guys are next to each other. How about this? You come over here and use your bubble power. Right there. Chris, pretty good. Okay, he's running. The noise does suck. Disorients a little bit. Okay, solid dodge there. Ray, go follow. Oh, wow. She's, like, way ahead now. I mean, probably needs to hold off a little bit. Okay, so you... There's two guys right here. We have a witch power. We can totally take him. There we go. Good job. Sion. This guy lined up for a beam. Go, go, go! I mean, I don't think there's really a lineup to do. But... Oh, the beam's still on cooldown. Okay, just get your vigor back then. We'll, we'll get him. He's trying to run for it. Okay, so this guy's trying to run for it. So is this guy. So now... I'm too far north for this, but Ray's in the right area. I want to make sure they don't make it to the exit, so come back over this way. Yeah, so that's where they're coming in. Maybe that's how they escaped last time? Sure. Make sure no one else is trying to escape. Oh, there's a white tiger over there. Okay, so we saw somebody. That was bound to happen. Um, behind cover, but not great cover. I guess not. Okay, Anne, come over here. Ow. Okay, Ray. There is a bad guy trying to escape, and maybe even one over here that we don't know about. So, why don't you come over to this side? Okay, we got a bunch of people over there. We got some people going, trying to run away from us. Hexing, you go back over here. You need to take out this beast before he runs away. I was so close yet so far. I mean, our only objective is to take out the beast. The white tiger doesn't actually matter. Okay, and he's better cover, for sure. Okay, so the beast is over there. 
Irene, I don't think you have line of sight. Alright, she's gonna have to go intercept the beast when it gets over this way. Okay. Good for stalemate. Nice. And levels up. Fantastic. Attack mastery slot expanded. Great. Um, go ahead and shoot somebody, why don't you? Sure, the butcher, why not? Actually, are they close enough? Oh yeah, we can totally hit both of them. Do that instead. Alright, took down one. Would have taken down the other one, but he has impulse fields up. Ow. Jerk. Okay. I mean, the bubble would be great, but we don't have the bubble until another turn, so we need to go somewhere for this. Or Gust. Gust might just take down the Butcher. The Scoundrels are pretty bad with that freaking... don't know what that is. Blackmailer. I think we gotta take out... Oh, Andres also needs to be taken out. We have a bad shot on him, though. 100% here. Uh, Impulse Fields just stops from being one hit, but this should kill him. There we go. Slip off. Trigger with an enemy with icy road field. Pushes back a target for more than three tiles. Activate slowdown with slip off. I mean, he, the guy is dead. <laughs> we, can't, we can't do another thing. He's dead. Okay, Anne's in a bit of trouble. Alright, Hexing, you have a shot on this guy? Oh, not that guy. I mean, I guess you might as well take a shot on that guy, because whatever. So have this, the put distance. Um, does that do again? In melee, deals 50 blunt damage with powerful kick after firing a warning shot to the enemy. Target's knocked back three tiles, and the action time decreased by 60. Activates the very brilliant beginning. Okay, sure, why not? Let's do that. Put some distance. Or just murder him. Also possible. Okay, we can't see the other guy. That guy's going to be Irene's responsibility now. We can't see him. Got to go help out Albus and gang over there. Speaking of which, Scion has like no cover. Here, do this. And cover, cover, no cover, cover. Cover here. Can't do anything though. Okay, Ray. There should be a guy trying to get past you here. I don't see him, though. He's got to be, like, past here already. Okay, Irene. It's up to you, then. Oh, there's totally a guy right here. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. 90%. I like it. Do it. Want to get next to him, so if he tries to move, we miss. We didn't miss. We're good. Oh, is that the last... That was sort of the last... That was... The, oh, my God. That was probably the guy who escaped last time, too. Andre, sir, most beasts were defeated by troubleshooters. It'd be hard to leave here unnoticed because of the siege. Peace of the universe. Let's split up and return to the residence area for now. Yep, that was totally it. I think there are no more beasts left in the park. Everyone did excellent in this harsh weather. Everyone who did well. Thank you all for the effort. And Sister Ray, thank you. Okay, thank you. Let's go back. I'm too hungry. Shall we return to the office? Albus, let's draw by Yusuke's food cart on the way back. It's near here. I agree. Shall we go then? Who is this guy who keeps spying on us? Alright, well that was better. It's kind of funny we just need to defeat the bad guys. I guess yeah, I should have just ignored the white tiger entirely, but... Alright, live and learn. Objective matters above all. Which I guess we kind of knew already. We got everyone else maxed on their... Um, on their skill tree, which is great. Oh, it's funny. I always thought that was a cross on Irene's neck. It is not. That is an X. I don't know why she has an X around her neck. But she does. I mean, why do people have crosses around their neck, I guess? It's just, you know, it's important to them. Oh, phone call. Inspector Jane? Um, she's probably no longer an inspector. Thing is how she did some illegal search and seizure last time we saw her. Yes, Albus. 
Is it an emergency situation? I would have used the mission control panel if it was an emergency. Oh, right. Would you guys want to join the police training? The police training? It's a yearly event to reinforce the connection between the police and the troubleshooters. Other troubleshooters joined this event until last year, but I would like you guys to join the event this time. Not sure that we can be a great help. It would be better for us to train with you guys rather than train with those who are afraid of violent cases. Wow! Quite the dig there. I mean, I don't know if they're afraid necessarily, they're just going for what's more profitable. Really, you gotta talk to the government about making standard violent cases more profitable than going out resource hunting. I mean, I know the resources are important, and that's why there's a bounty on them, but still. That's why the troubleshooters aren't doing the violent cases. It's nice, easy work for more pay. I mean, why wouldn't they do that? You won't be able to earn loot like in normal cases, but since it's an official event, there will be rewards. Feel free to contact me and choose a date that would be comfortable for your company. Yes, we'll contact you soon. Alright, so that's probably a new event. Yep, suggestion over there. Okay. Let's get everyone motivated. Pretty sure the motivation is not too bad. Yeah, okay, we're mostly good. Alright, everyone. Get some juice. I would normally do beer. You know what? Instead of juice, how about some sweet cocoa? It's apparently really cold outside. Have a nice warm cocoa. There we go. Alright, so everyone's properly motivated now. Otherwise, we're good. Let's make sure we don't need to identify anything. Oh, yeah, tons of stuff to identify. There we go. Identify all. Thank you. Uh, identify all of that, too. There. Alright. 100 points increase, though I don't know if we necessarily care about Neil. Uh, Puerto, do you have anything good? And we do have these nice, fancy blades that are level 25. Uh, we're already using something great. Uh, part level 35 would be better, but it's not much of an improvement. Not a hugely, huge improvement like it used to be. Yeah, part cool. level 30. Okay, we're not there yet. We're not there yet, but we totally will be. Berserker's Battle Club of Delivery Man. On both Scion and Irene, but it's attack power, not ESP. No, but I think the ESP power is probably better for us. Ooh, automatic rifle. I don't know if that's good for hexing at all. Alright, well, we're doing pretty well right now. We'll probably go ahead and do Jane's suggestion, because that's probably level appropriate. Oh, let's look at our email. Gazelle. Albus, you were the first one to survive for a full year period under my temper, and I want you to know that I really care about you. Therefore, I thought that you'd come back to Black Pearl. I was going to assign you to my team, but it was too bad you decided to leave. Attach the stuff I was planning to give you when you turn to Black Pearl. You'll need this since you're a boss who needs to work hard on sites. Use it well, since as I was given to you anyway for you to return. And the only senior troubleshooters who led you to the world, troubleshooters, Gazelle. Okay, 300 training manual. I suppose that's nice. We don't really need that. We're getting plenty of it, but thanks. A reward for arresting Gary. Oh, right. We actually got Gary defeated. Okay. Again, actually. I think this is the second time. So interesting, you can farm this reward and just get more vill for that? Well, I say farm. That is a difficult mission. That was the last episode. That was not easy. Alright, well that'll do it for this episode. Thanks for watching. This has been Troubleshooter Abandoned Children. I'm Peace Universe, you're Peace Universe 2, and I'll see you guys next time.